Dementia is a growing public health concern in Canada and worldwide. In Canada alone, over half a million people are living with dementia. That number will double in the next 15 years. But dementia isn't just a Canadian issue, it's a global one. With aging populations worldwide, countries are grappling with the challenges posed by dementia and how to provide care and support for those affected. What is dementia? Dementia is a condition that makes it difficult for people to remember things, think clearly, and interact with others. Different brain problems, such as diseases or injuries, can cause dementia. But it's not just about trouble with thinking and memory. It also makes it hard for people to do everyday things. Symptoms of dementia can make it difficult to do regular activities. Now let's explore the five early signs. 1. Need help organizing and planning things. 2. Personality changes. 3. Sensory dysfunction that affects smell, taste, hearing, eyesight, and appetite. 4. Language problems such as difficulty finding or mixing words. And 5. Inability to navigate well in new places, indicating spatial disorientation. For example, someone with dementia might lose things, get lost easily, forget to pay bills, have trouble planning, or have difficulty making meals. Living with dementia can be a challenging journey, often filled with fear, uncertainty, and cultural stigma. Many people with dementia hide their struggles, fearing judgment and ostracization from their communities. In some cultural backgrounds, dementia is seen as a punishment rather than a disease, adding to the stigma and reluctance to seek help. Imagine feeling stressed or tired and suddenly exhibiting symptoms that seem like dementia. Jumping to conclusions and self-diagnosing can be harmful. Occasional memory lapses may not always be dementia. Stress, fatigue, and sleep disturbances can mimic symptoms. These signs may indicate other issues like sleep disturbances or blood sugar imbalances, but addressing them early is crucial. The overwhelming nature of dementia can leave individuals feeling anxious about their future and uncertain where to turn for support. Denial is common, with many believing they can't function as well as they used to, leading to frustration and anger. Primary prevention means doing things to keep your brain healthy and reduce the risk of dementia. For example, eating healthy foods like fruits, vegetables, and whole grains can help keep your brain strong. Regular exercise and getting enough sleep can also help. It is also important to avoid things like smoking and drinking too much alcohol, as these can harm your brain. Secondary prevention involves catching dementia early and slowing its progress. Regular checkups with the doctor can help catch any problems early on. If someone starts having trouble with their memory or thinking, seeing a doctor immediately is essential. They can offer treatments or strategies to help manage the symptoms and slow down the progression of dementia. Tertiary prevention is about supporting and caring for people with dementia. For example, creating a safe space and supportive environment at home is crucial for someone with dementia. This might include moving tripping hazards, labeling drawers and cabinets, and keeping a consistent daily routine. Family members and caregivers can also learn about dementia and how to communicate effectively with their loved ones. If you or someone you know has these early signs of dementia, don't worry, help is available. Reach out to support groups or a local doctor. Understanding how severe and complicated dementia is can encourage you to seek help sooner and get the needed support for those with it. Living with dementia is a complex journey, but with understanding, support, and compassion, individuals can navigate these challenges and find moments of joy and connection. Let's work together to break the stigma and create a more inclusive and supportive community for everyone affected by dementia. Let's support those with dementia and ensure everyone can live well. Thanks for watching.